Have you ever wondered what would happen if your computer was suddenly locked and the only way to unlock it was to pay a hefty sum to a faceless criminal? This nightmare scenario is not a work of fiction, but a very real threat in our digital age known as ransomware. Ransomware is a type of malicious software that encrypts a victim's files. The attacker then demands a ransom from the victim to restore access to the data upon payment. This form of cybercrime can disrupt businesses and lives, and it's been a growing concern for governments, corporations, and individuals alike. The history of ransomware can be traced back to the late 80s. The AIDS Trojan incident in 1989 is often considered the first known ransomware attack. A biologist named Joseph Pop distributed 20,000 infected floppy disks to attendees of the World Health Organization's International AIDS Conference. The disks, labeled AIDS Information, Introductory Diskettes, contained a malicious program that, after a certain number of reboots, hid directories and encrypted the names of the files on the victim's computer. A ransom note delivered via snail mail then demanded payment to fix the issue. The simplicity of this early ransomware attack is striking. It used basic encryption and relied on physical distribution and postal mail. Its impact was relatively limited due to the infancy of the internet, but it demonstrated the potential for cyber criminals to exploit the growing reliance on digital data and systems. Ransomware attacks have, of course, evolved since then, becoming more sophisticated and potentially devastating. But the basic principle remains the same. Your data is taken hostage and you have to pay to get it back. The evolution of ransomware is a testament to the ingenuity of criminals in exploiting technological advancements for their own gain. While these early attacks were primitive, they paved the way for a new era of cybercrime. This is a world where anyone can become a victim, where your most valuable asset, your data, can be held for ransom. And the story of ransomware is far from over. As technology advanced, so did the sophistication of ransomware attacks. The genesis of ransomware can be traced back to the late 80s, with the AIDS Trojan, a relatively simple piece of malware that hid directories and encrypted the names of all the files on the C drive of a victim's computer. However, these early attacks were rudimentary, often using basic lockout mechanisms that could be bypassed by savvy users. Then came the 2000s and the advent of the Internet age. This gave birth to a new era of ransomware that was far more sophisticated and insidious. One of the major turning points was in 2012, with the emergence of the Reviton ransomware. This malware locked victims out of their systems and displayed a message purporting to be from a law enforcement agency, claiming that the user had committed an illegal activity and needed to pay a fine. This was a psychological manipulation tactic, capitalizing on fear and uncertainty to coerce victims into paying the ransom. But the evolution didn't stop there. The following year, in 2013, we saw the Crypto Locker attack. This was a game changer. Crypto Locker didn't just lock users out of their systems, it encrypted their files. And it used a robust encryption algorithm that couldn't be broken without the unique key held by the attackers. This meant that victims had no choice but to pay if they wanted to regain access to their files. Alongside the evolution of the ransomware itself, we also saw a shift in the means of payment. Early ransomware attacks often demanded payment via premium rate text messages, but as anonymous digital currencies like Bitcoin began to rise in popularity, they became the preferred method of payment for cyber criminals. This has made tracing the perpetrators and recovering funds even more difficult. The evolution of ransomware is a stark reminder of how the advancements in technology can be a double-edged sword. Yes, it has brought about numerous benefits, but it has also opened up new avenues for criminal activity. As the world became more interconnected, the stakes grew higher. With the rise of the digital age, ransomware attacks reached a new level of notoriety. In the year 2017, we witnessed two of the most devastating ransomware attacks in history, WannaCry and NotPetya. WannaCry, a malicious software that spread across 150 countries, infected more than 200,000 computers. It paralyzed hospitals in the United Kingdom, disrupted rail stations in Germany, and halted production at a Renault factory in France. The perpetrators demanded payment in Bitcoin, a digital currency, to unlock the infected systems. The global impact was staggering, estimated in billions of dollars. In the same year, NotPetya, initially targeted at Ukraine, quickly spread globally, causing chaos and disruption. It masqueraded as a common type of ransomware Petya, but its main goal was destruction, not extortion. 
It wiped out data on infected systems, crippling multinational companies, and causing estimated damages of over $10 billion. These mass attacks were a wake-up call to the world, highlighting the destructive potential of ransomware. They exposed the vulnerabilities in our digital infrastructure and the ease with which cybercriminals could exploit them. In response, cybersecurity experts worldwide rallied to combat these threats. They developed decryption tools to help victims unlock their systems without paying ransoms. Governments and private sectors collaborated like never before, sharing intelligence and resources to trace and shut down the operations of these cybercriminals. New laws were enacted to tighten cybersecurity regulations, and massive investments were made in strengthening digital defenses. However, the battle against ransomware is far from over. The landscape of cyber threats is ever-evolving, with ransomware becoming more sophisticated and targeted. The rise of cryptocurrencies has also made it easier for cybercriminals to demand and receive ransoms anonymously, making them harder to trace and prosecute. These widespread attacks demonstrated the destructive potential of ransomware, prompting a global call to action. The age of mass ransomware attacks underlined the urgency to build robust digital defenses, foster international cooperation, and promote public awareness about these threats. It's a battle we must continue to fight for the security of our digital world depends on it. In today's digital world, ransomware continues to pose a significant threat. As we move further into the 21st century, the landscape of cyber threats is continually evolving, with ransomware leading the pack. This malicious software is not just a bug that's buzzing around, it's a full-blown storm that's causing havoc in both the private sector and government entities across the globe. Recent years have seen a concerning rise in targeted ransomware attacks. Cybercriminals, armed with increasingly sophisticated tools, are setting their sights on large corporations and government bodies. These are not random attacks. They are calculated, strategic, and devastatingly effective. They exploit vulnerabilities, seize control of systems, and demand hefty ransoms in exchange for the promise of restoring access. A particularly disturbing trend is the rise of ransomware as a service, or RAS. This model allows even the most novice of criminals to launch complex attacks. RAS providers offer ransomware tools for rent or sale, effectively democratizing the threat landscape. This means that the barrier to entry for cybercrime has been lowered significantly, making it easier for more people to participate in these malicious activities. The sophistication of these attacks is also increasing. Cybercriminals are no longer just encrypting files and demanding payment. They are stealing sensitive data, threatening to release it publicly if the ransom isn't paid. This double extortion method adds an extra layer of pressure on the victims to comply with the attacker's demands. But it's not all doom and gloom. The cybersecurity community is tirelessly working to combat this threat. New technologies and strategies are being developed to detect and prevent ransomware attacks. These include advanced AI systems that can identify suspicious activity and robust backup solutions that can help organizations recover quickly if they do fall victim to an attack. As we continue to rely on digital infrastructure, the fight against ransomware remains a top priority. We are in a constant game of cat and mouse with cyber criminals, but with continued vigilance and innovation, we can keep our systems and our data safe. So, what have we learned from our journey through the history of ransomware? Ransomware, as we've discovered, is not some new age digital menace. It's been evolving, growing, and adapting, much like a biological organism, since the late 80s. From the simple beginnings of the AIDS Trojan, ransomware has morphed into an imposing threat to governments, businesses, and individuals alike. The age of mass ransomware attacks brought with it a new level of sophistication and scale. Cybercriminals became more audacious, targeting entire city infrastructures, hospitals, and even national governments. The impact of these attacks is not just financial. They disrupt lives, compromise national security, and erode public trust in digital systems. But as the threat evolved, so did our defenses. Anti-ransomware technologies have been developed, law enforcement agencies worldwide are ramping up their cybercrime units, and governments are enacting laws to punish cybercriminals. The cybersecurity community is continually learning, adapting, and preparing for the next wave of attacks. Yet the fight against ransomware is far from over. It's a constant game of cat and mouse, a never-ending cycle of attack and defense. Cybersecurity is not just about building higher walls. It's about understanding the enemy, anticipating their moves, and being prepared for the unexpected. We've also learned that everyone has a role to play in cybersecurity. 
Whether you're an IT professional, a government official, or just an average internet user, your actions matter. Simple steps like regular data backups, updating software, and being cautious of suspicious emails can make a big difference. As we journeyed through the history of ransomware, we've seen its potential for destruction, but we've also seen the resilience and determination of those who stand against it. Remember, cybersecurity is not a destination, but a continuous journey. It requires constant vigilance, ongoing education, and persistent action. As we move forward, remember that the best defense against ransomware is knowledge and preparation. Stay safe, stay vigilant, and always keep your data protected.